Hello, welcome back. In this tutorial, we're going to add a footer, social media icons, and a cover image to our blog page to make it look more interesting and complete. Since a new section can only be added below the existing one, we need to scroll down and click on the Add New Section button to add it. Please don't worry, I will show you how to reorder the section as soon as we create it, since I want my cover section to be the first element on the page. So let's click on the Add New Section button, select Type Cover, and pick a template. I'm going to pick the template to cover two. Now, when the section is created, let's move it to the top of the page. To do that, we click on the Edit Section button that can be found in the top right corner of any section. Click on Reorder Sections, and then simply drag and drop the section by holding the mouse cursor over the arrow. Before adding a footer, I want to adjust my cover section a little. I'm going to remove the menu links from it by clicking on Pen icon, Delete. I'm going to change my title to something simple like Welcome to my blog page by clicking on the pen icon, Change Content. Apart from this, I want to have social media links below my title. We can add them by using the Add Element Below option. Simply click on the pen icon near the title, Add Element Below, find social media on the list and click on it. I want my links displayed as icons, not as text. To change that, click on the pen icon near links, icon style and behavior, and select the option icon. If you need to adjust the color and size, you can use the text color and font size options below. Now we only need to configure the links themselves, and we're good to go. Click on the pen icon again, go to change content, click on the link to select it. Under link to, you need to adjust the URL. Please make sure that you keep the formatting of the link the same, so the link needs to include HTTPS and www before it. Once it's adjusted, click on the Done button and save changes. At the moment, we are seeing a sample image. It can be replaced by clicking on Edit Image, Change Content, Change, Add image or video. Select our file and click Use the item. And the image is replaced. Our cover page is almost ready. Now let's add a footer to the ending of the page. Scroll to the bottom, click on Add new section, select option Footer, and pick a template. We will edit the year by double-clicking on the content that we want to edit. You can do this with any content that you want to edit. I will enter the right year and click on Done. It seems our blog page is ready now. In the last tutorial, we're going to cover the blog settings. If you found this tutorial helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay tuned.